So I'm here on the floor at Mobile World Congress Las Vegas and I'm joined by Manish Singh from Dell Technologies and Paul Miller from Wind River. So my first question is going to be for Paul and I was hoping you could tell me a little bit about how CSPs are rolling out VRAN and OpenRAN and what Wind River is doing to support that. Sure Catherine. So over the past few years we've seen a pretty significant transformation in the way people are building 5G networks. They're moving towards virtualized approaches for doing that. And after several years of investment, we've produced a product we call Wind River Studio, which is now being used globally for the deployment of virtual RAN and open RAN with significant successes at companies like Verizon and Vodafone. And that has really um, paved the way for the ability to build virtual networks for the RAN 5G architecture. At the same time as we've been developing that technology, we've discovered what it really is like operationally for a customer to try to deploy it. It's very difficult and complicated to deploy a virtualized solution in the RAN network. And as a result of that, we're seeing a slower than normal adoption of the technology. And, and that's partially uh, the reason why we're here today to talk about what we're doing with Dell. Yes, and we are here because you two have partnered on the Dell Telecom Infrastructure Block. So, first of all, what is that? And second of all, how is working with Wind River, like how is that the answer here? Yeah, great. So, look, I mean, as Paul said, there have been challenges that the operators have been facing in, in rolling out cloud native infrastructure for the RAN in particular because that's a geo-distributed infrastructure and system integration has been one of the challenges that has been talked about. What this partnership has done is work Dell along with Wind River has now partnered to really take on and solve that integration challenge. Dell Telecom Infrastructure Block for Wind River is a fully integrated solution which comprises of Dell PowerEdge server portfolio, our bare metal orchestrator, and Wind River Studio, all fully integrated. What does that mean? What does that bring to the operator? What that brings to the operator is a fully integrated solution that's factory integrated. It, makes, it brings a lot of automation for deployment and lifecycle management, from firmware to bio settings to all the way uh, the CAS software layer. It brings capabilities for a lot of analytics to do interesting closed loop automation around that. And the overarching objective is to again, accelerate the network transformation for these service providers, especially in the RAN workloads, which are out and about uh, in the field. Sounds like there's a lot of benefits here. Uh, Paul, can you talk uh, from your perspective about the integration that the two of you are doing together and how customers will benefit from it? Yeah, glad to. Uh, we're very excited about what we're created here. Um, there's a a significant complexity to adopting open RAN and virtual RAN solutions. You have a kind of disaggregated solution where you have a, a hardware asset at the bottom of the architecture, virtualization technology on top of that, and then a variety of applications on top of that. And, and as a result of trying to adopt that technology, our customers are attempting to integrate that themselves. And that creates significant cost burdens for them and significant you know, complexities to adopt the technology. The result of what we're doing together with Dell eliminates a huge amount of that complexity. By having a continuously integrated solution, that entire technology stack, including the software, the bare metal orchestration, as Manish mentioned, uh, the best in class server hardware that you can obtain in the market, as a continuously validated, complete solution, eliminates a huge amount of the complexity and work that our customers have to do to deploy this. And we believe that will have a significant impact on the adoption of OpenRAN as a, as a new technology. And maybe just building on Paul's Absolutely. point, just one other thing. We did work with ACG research, okay. and out what we've they've figured out is based on this integration, the operators will be able to realize more than 40% OPEX reduction and more than 130% in terms of TCO reduction. That's a huge benefit that right. we'll be passing on to the operator. Absolutely. So Manish, it's my understanding that you both have a unified support model. Can you tell me more about that? Yeah, exactly. Goes back to that integration problem that I've talked about as we disaggregate, we have to re-aggregate, and service providers have talked about the challenge that how do you work in a multi-vendor ecosystem. What, in partnership with Wind River, what Dell and Wind River are doing is providing a unified support model to the service providers. What that means is when the service provider makes the call to Dell, we take the first line support and there's infrastructure set up with Wind River for higher levels of support. So it provides a unified support to the service provider and in addition to that, what Dell has also done is now providing you know, carrier grade SLAs for response and restore. So this is important because we're not, not talking about IT infrastructure, we're talking about telco grade infrastructure. Mm -hmm. And then further, 
Uh, we, will, we are also bringing new services built around our OTEL, the Open Telecom Ecosystem Lab, where we can further create custom configurations and also do uh, you know, workload integration. Rather towards that, earlier uh, here at Mobile World Congress, Dell announced the partner certification program on OTEL, which is really again working with different ecosystem partners over and above this partnership to create certified solutions on these platforms. And, and I'll add to that as well that uh, that single support model is incredibly important. The service providers are running networks that carry emergency 911 calls that everybody's used to trusting that it's always going to be there. And our ability to respond quickly to a service outage and provide recovery services as a unified solution is going to significantly reduce outage time and any impacts to the operational aspects of the carrier business. And that really uh, improves the quality of the solution to the end customer. Okay, this next question is for both of you, but I'm going to start with Paul. How are the pair of you helping Vodafone on their Open RAN journey? Well, Vodafone's a really exciting customer. They've really embraced Open RAN as a new technology, and it's important to them because it enables a new uh, business model where they have competition not only vertically in the solution, but also east-west interoperability between different software providers. And uh, Dell and Wind River are working very closely in the production deployment. That is Europe's first deployment of Open RAN. We're very proud to be involved with that, and Vodafone's a, a very progressive customer that's working hard to make that successful with us. Yeah, I mean, to Paul's point, I mean, Vodafone is very much at the forefront of open RAN, of bringing cloud native infrastructure and, and running uh, you know, disaggregated RAN workloads on that cloud native infrastructure. And again, really excited to be partnering with Wind River, supporting Vodafone, and the goal is again, especially with this Dell Telecom infrastructure block with Wind River, the goal is to again accelerate that journey for Vodafone and for other service providers. Yes. Yeah, so the last thing I want to get from both of you is how you feel Dell and Wind River are really differentiating themselves in this market. Yeah, I mean, Dell's a global leader in servers, bringing a very vast variety of server portfolio, along with Converge and Hyper-Converge infrastructure, working with a number of customers in their digital transformation journey. And we're leveraging all that experience, now making critical investments in telecom to really accelerate the network transformation journey for our service providers. And to give you some examples, uh, we brought in a whole range of servers now, which are telco grade, NEPS compliant, short depth, uh, front IO, and more. We're bringing in bare metal orchestrator to really automate the infrastructure layer from a deployment and lifecycle management. We are, we are strategically investing in OTEL, Open Telecom Ecosystem Lab that I talked about, uh, which is really a playground for bringing the ecosystem together. Keep it open, keep it disaggregated, but do all that undifferentiated heavy lifting that otherwise has to be done. So there are a number of things that we are doing, and of course, you know, leveraging the Dell's global supply chain, which again, we'll be bringing that to the service providers. Paul, what about you? What are your thoughts? So, Wind River started with Studio several years ago, building and deploying virtual and open RAN networks, and uh, that we really have a set of differentiated capabilities there around single pane of glass and zero touch deployment and some really interesting operational and technological performance capabilities that are very differentiated against the competition. However, what we're most excited about today is in combination with Dell, now fully integrating that solution, we've been able to solve some significant operational challenges that we found our customers have in live running networks. As they run networks, they have often the, the interaction between the software and hardware that has to be rationalized in order to service the systems. Now with a fully integrated solution, that becomes incredibly easy and no other solution on the planet is offering that capability and it's a significant differentiator in the market. I mean, it sounds like a great partnership, so thank you both so much. Thank, thank you. you very much. Thank you.